Randy Wagner will tee off for Make-A-Wish some 150 times in the next 24 hours at Angel Park. This is a 24-hour golf tournament. That's right. Um, started a couple years ago. We did it, and I did it by myself with just one friend. Mm -hmm. It was successful, raised over $20,000. I figured, why not find more golfers that want to come out and make a difference? So I know there's somebody out there sitting on their couch going, I want to make a difference, and I love golf, and, and uh, all you need to do is contact, you know, make a wish of Southern Nevada. But the coverage that it gets and uh, the way people have wanted to be a part of it now, it's amazing, it's very humbling. He spent all day, 24 hours, golfing for a cause. His name is Randy Wagner, and we caught up with him just as he entered his 22nd straight hour on the course. From sun up until sundown and back up again, Wagner teed up and swung for the Make-A-Wish Foundation of Southern Nevada. His name's Aaron, he's four years old. He's battling a, a form of sickle cell, and, and he wanted to go to Disneyland and have pancakes with Mickey Mouse. In the end, Wagner played this nine-hole course 20 times, all for little Aaron. Spent a lot of his life in high hospitals and doctor's offices and he's such a brave young man and, and uh, battles so hard. The inspiration behind the Wish Upon a Par campaign came from Wagner's late mother. Years ago he lost her to cancer. He took the first swing on April 4th, her birthday. I know a lot of people maybe have lost their parents, how they feel on their parents' birthday and it's always been sad to me but this year uh, I got to play golf all day and, and I got to do something good. And good has been done. In the end, Wagner secured enough to meet his goal, granting one little boy's wish on his mother's birthday. Crystal, I just love that story.